Solar Power Health Cells Breathe Cleaner. It also keeps pollution away and helps nature recover from the dangerous levels of pollution it is subjected to. Today, we are going to see an amazing initiative and great commitment which is going to help reduce climate change. And our sustainable partner in this epic journey is going to be the new Mahindra XUV 400 EL Pro. Now with new interiors, better features and homes. Hello and welcome back to Shutter Drives. It's very important for me to tackle the Bangalore City's traffic, but I don't have to break my head too much because the XUV 400 EL Pro gets the best in segment. Thermal management for the battery and it ensures that the battery is cool. The XUV400 EL Pro now comes with a 50 kW DC fast charging capacity, which means that the 0 to 80% of the juice can be opened in just under 50 minutes. Range anxiety is one of the biggest concerns in any electric vehicle but I don't have to worry much because the XUV 400 EL Pro gets a claimed range of 375 km in just one full battery pack all thanks to the new 34.5 kWh battery So it's time to break the ice and reveal the suspense, the destination for the day that is the Pavagada Solar Park. The reason why government actually chose Pavagada Solar Park is because it's heavily prone to droughts and it's in a very remote location. And now when you think of going to a very remote location, the first thing that comes to mind is map is there going to be an accessibility of GPS, mobile network or whatnot. But not to worry because when the all new 10.25 inch infotainment system of the XUV 400 EL Pro, you have an option of wireless and auto, Apple CarPlay, and of course, built in navigation with Map My India. We actually have the navigation displayed here. And not just that, you get a new flat bottom steering wheel to make things slightly sportier and pippier here. The XUV 400 EL Pro now gets a dual zone climate control, which means you can set a colder temperature, she can set a hotter temperature. You get a proper wireless charger with a cooling function, not just that, in case you forget your phone in the car and try to move out, the car will remind you that you have forgotten your phone in the car. India is a tropical country and rare AC winds are something which was slightly missed in the earlier XV 4 w and Mahindra has ensured that the EL Pro gets them and that's why you have proper rare AC winds. Not just that, there's a dedicated storage space for your mobile phone which will be good enough and there's a type c charging port as well apart from the 12 volt charging socket of course we are at the world's third largest solar park which is in karnataka in fact this was the largest solar park in the world for a very long time until china and rajasthan took over this solar park is 13,000 acres huge and this was built at a cost of 15,000 crore rupees. This has a production capacity of 2,050 megawatts and even in the worst of the worst weather conditions, this can at least generate 500 megawatts which means that at least 25% of the production capacity is met even in the worst of the worst rainy conditions. Just like the XV4W EL Pro which is on a mission to make the planet cleaner and greener, this solar park has a direct impact. This is responsible in meeting 12% of Karnataka's entire electricity demand. So let's understand in simple words, how does this solar park work to ensure that you get electricity at your house? So this is one typical solar panel that you see here. It has 72 small panels inside it. As soon as sunlight strikes this particular panel, there's movement of electrons and protons inside it, which generate current and voltage. One particular line is called as a table. At the end of every table, there is a SCB. 
So this is a string monitoring board or an SCB and it collects all the voltage and current which is obtained in one particular table or line of the solar panels that you see here. And from this SCB, the voltage and current is actually sent to an inverter. Since it is not possible to use DC current directly, these inverters convert DC current to AC current for everyday usage in household purposes. Now the current and voltage balance from the inverter isn't exactly practical enough for everyday usage and that is why it's very very important to step up the voltage and that is done by this transformer you see behind me. And from the transformer the current moves to various power grids and then it finally reaches your house to light up your life. Paogada was chosen as the site for this project for several reasons. Apart from the high solar radiation and availability of land, this region receives very little rainfall. Besides generating a huge amount of clean green energy, it has also directly benefited more than 2300 farmers. It's a part of Karnataka government's effort to increase sustainability. It is truly a sight to behold. Apart from creating an alternative source of energy, the park also aims at providing employment for locals. Given the drought faced by this area in the past few years, this could help curb the migration rate of people from this region. Right on then, it is getting dark and we must head back to the city. The excellent headlights of the XUV 4 el Pro are a boon in such situations.